metal roof and fire resistant siding if you're concerned about fire issues. The land was purchased in 2008 and it was built and completed in early 2009. Custom built by Tony Wallace from Trout Lake. He's the same builder that built the cabins at Serenity right prior to getting to the Trout, uh, Trout Lake stove here that's supposed to heat 800 square feet, which is more than this place is. That way you don't have wood to mess with, the dirt of wood. Also, it has a propane stove and a propane on-demand hot water heater. So all I have to do is set the thermostat and at any time, uh, thermostatically, just set the temperature and even if the power goes off, the propane fireplace will kick on and heat the place. You don't have to worry about uh, power going off when I'm not here and the pipes freezing up. And if the power would go off, you still have the propane stove you can use. You still have heat. We got city water from Glendale from some springs they have here. The power coming into the property is all underground. The roads are kept open all year round. It's easy to get up here. There is a road maintenance agreement for the property here on this lane coming back here. Some local neighbor guy plows it, so it requires a, there's a certain fee I pay every once a year for snow plowing. About $150, I think it is. It's a half mile from the Mount Adams Highway back here, and it's about 1.8 miles to the little town of Glenwood. The stairwell is handcrafted by the builder. He had to build it, he did it all himself. He even got his little mark up there on that. And it's solid. You ever had any problems with break-ins? Nope, that's another thing. I'll, this place is secure. You know, it's one way in. And th this community up here is, is a good community. You know, they don't they don't have problems, period, with theft or, I don't, I've never heard of any drugs. Absolutely, they didn't go in the cabin. Yeah, bust something. Now this place is really, it's uh, secure. It's a great place. It's just, uh, it's, you know, it's more of a somebody that wants a little get a getaway. You know, it'd be great for someone that, from Portland that wants to come up here and have a place. You know? yeah. Yeah. You come up here for vacation. Yeah, taxes aren't aren't that. I mean, actually, it's not that cheap. Uh, not that expensive to, have to keep this place. The taxes right now are are about 500 bucks. You know. Yeah, and you know they get, believe it or not, they don't get as much snow here oftentimes as they do down in Trout Lake. Maybe because we're a little farther east, but uh, last winter didn't have much snow here at all. 
but then uh, there was a, I think the winter before they, there was a couple of big snows, like you know, three, one time there was like four feet, but, but in general I don't think they get as much snow up here as they do down in the valley. I've never been here when there's been a big dumping. The most I've ever had was six inches when I was here. Come in, good boy, my good boy. Eight by ten, custom built shed, engineered for extra snow weight. 